Go find it, tiger. Okay, Mary Jane, what is this creature? Face it, tiger. You just hit the jackpot. Hey, it's me, your local greasy content lord. Ooh, interplay. This game's never getting a remaster anytime soon. So this is Wild 9 made by Shiny. Remember Shiny? I'm so shiny. This is their thing that they made. This is the thing that they made after Earthworm Jim. Or nothing that they made after that. Quite it like Earthworm Jim. But not to say that uh, any of this. Hell yeah, dog! The person who's worked on the most video games in their lifetime. Fuck! Awesome! We, ha we have a, a legend of the music industry with us today. So, Wild 9, I've owned a hard copy of this for a decade or something. Never actually played it. I did remember how this seemed to get quite a bit of hype in magazines and such. But I think when it came out, it kind of just came and went really, really quickly. Again, didn't quite hit like Earthworm Jim. It was a little weird because I remember its ad campaign being like torture. Torture is good. Torture everything. I don't, nobody, you have no limits to torture. And I, even as a kid, I was like, that's kind of weird. So Bombopolis, bomb this is a chaotic as hell menu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like this stuff. It's like killing a bunch of innocent creatures. Or maybe they're not innocent. I don't know what that weird goop monster. Goop baby. Okay, wow. We couldn't have start, start, ow. Oh, this is a little weird. All right, so I think it's strictly, even though it looks 3D, is strictly 2.5D. I'm sure people familiar with this game would know that more so than me. It's just not what I was expecting. Oh, I pressed one button and that tutorial went away. I'm assuming it was just to jump. Oh shit. Okay, yeah, this is the torture device. And you do stuff with it. Oh, uh, like that. Okay, they explode. So let me get this this guy. Jump into it once. Collect energy orbs to build up your rig power meter. Man, it reminds me a lot of the energy orbs that you see in Earthburn Ship. I'm just saying. I do want to do this again. I don't know why that guy respawns so hard, but collect 99 spinning nine gears to earn a game continue. This is a video game as a video game here. Uh, 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 uh. All right. So the rig is like, yeah, the uh, torture device that Sony Computer Entertainment of America and Interplay uh, were all into. They're well into torture. Karn's outposts are equipped with energy barriers to prevent uh, anything from passing from one section to the next. You are somehow immune to it. Must be the rig. Gotcha. I'm kind of shocked that there's no voiceovers yet. A little weird, huh? Any careless bonehead watching their step near floor uh, grinders will find themselves in a world of hurt. Yeah. Now as to the function, to a floor grinder, nobody knows. So I do want to bring this guy. You might want to try to jump. Yes, okay, thank you. I know it showed up pretty fast. So grinding has happened. That's, that's this game's thing, as far as I remember. All right, this will protect me. This bombs cannot stop this. Can I crush this guy? No, all right, that's fine. No, no, you. Okay, well I can crush with the box. That makes sense too, right? Can I grip onto myself and throw myself up? Doesn't seem like it. Yeah, I was trying to think, can I get the missiles? I don't think I can, or at least I can't. Oh, okay, well we learned, we learned. Oh geez, okay, it's, it's, it's an older game. 1998, that's significant. Eyeball, power up. Eyeball, power up? That was a weird thing to say. Don't really know what that was about. That's fine. All right, let's try. Let's try it. Hold on. Sir, just wait. There you go. No, not quite. Not quite. <laughs> okay. I feel like I'm a toddler with a new toy just slamming it down. I am kind of like that, actually. All right, let's try this again. I keep getting my ass kicked by this dude. All right. Didn't think this could actually grab him from that height. So we're learning as we're going. We're going as we're learning. Please don't tell me that was a level exit. I was that I was that close to it. Or the checkpoint. Wow, it like stole my soul. Neato. Uh, some fans already turned on so you can just jump into them. Others are missing their power source or require a battery. Go find it, tiger. Okay, Mary Jane. What is this creature? Face it, tiger. 
you just hit the jackpot. It's like a proto ja uh, a Daxter. I was about to call him Jackster, which is just is wrong. I personally think there should have been way more 2.5D platformers than there was. Uh, sustained rig fire will connect you to the swing point. Oh, that's neat. Hitting the directional buttons left and right will build up your swing momentum. Yeah! All right, cool, I'm, I'm, I'm down for that. After connecting to the swing, hitting up or down on the directional buttons will shorten or lengthen the beam. Make sure to keep those long jumps easier. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, not quite, not quite. Ugh, there you go. All, all you need is two chances, really. Dude. Oh, oh, fan shit. Uh, well, that's close enough. You got Mortal Kombat into my Earthworm Gym, essentially, right? Oh, give me more, more of that. Thank you. I don't, I cut. <laughs> that's pretty funny. And just throw them off. That's easy enough, right? Anything that can, okay. I don't know if that's, that's probably bad getting touched by that. These wind bubbles, that, that's that gotta be bad. Uh-oh. All right, let's get him in there just to see what it looks like. <laughs> I, you know what the nice thing about the screams of the enemies are? They're not annoying. <laughs> so down here, I'll just, looks like we're gonna have to jump. Oof, barely. I don't know if that was death down there. It doesn't seem like it. Seems like there's shit. Is this a, a kill thing? Guess not. Maybe we need a battery. Sorry, a battery for that to work. There it is. And you just need to slam it down with some level of authority. The most you can muster. What did that do? Turn off the music is what it did. Sorry, Tommy, if you did actually compose that music. My mother is very proud. Good stuff. <laughs> Fair enough. I'll take that. I'll take that out. No problem. I'll take that. I'll take that every time. There you go. Thank you. This guy. Awesome, big progress. This is, this is, except for the, the, how long that splat animation is, this is, this is kind of enjoyable so far. Do you want to see where it goes? If you're out of missiles, just stand on the symbol and a member from the resistance will send out more missile ammo. Sorry, missiles? What missiles? I even know I can shoot missiles. Oh, now I have missiles, okay. I only have three of these, so now I really don't want to like experiment into which button actually does this shit. Ah, uh, missile. There you go. Ow. Okay, well, at least my at least my attacker got what was coming to him. Cool. Oh, it's these little globules. Uh, little evil green men. They're tiny. They're relentless. They're toxic. Why are they toxic? Three missiles should destroy the generator. Okay, so just keep shooting missiles. Gotcha. Toxic masculinity is dead! Why would this be created? Why? I know it's a crazy sci-fi world or whatever, but still, it begs the question. Uh, uh. It's like you're the most lethal Spider-Man ever, but you have like an energy web tether and you're killing everybody. So yeah, it's quite different from Spider-Man. <laughs> the grinder, remember the grinder? Ugh, I need to talk about the grinder on a what happened or something. Damn. The, the, the real ones know what the fuck I'm talking about in regards to the grinder. All right, that's good stuff. I do want to get whatever's up there, though. Yeah, take it. I don't need my soul. That's fine. Just grab it. Oh, oh, yeah. Can't waste this opportunity. Oh, I did. Never mind. <laughs> oh, you know what these energy globules? I said Earthworm Jim, and it does remind me of that a little bit, but I'm actually thinking of Vector Man a little bit more. Vector Man's coming back. Sega's uh, doing that new energy thing, new revivals, and they want that rebellious energy. And there's nothing more rebellious than <laughs> fucking Vector Man. You know it, you know it. Okay, how will I actually, I think I need to destroy this with more bodies. Who wants to play bodies, bodies, bodies? It's steaming, it's chunking up. That's gotta be it, right? How could it take more than three? I'm playing a video game here. <laughs> Thanks, sign. Uh, Oh, okay. I got, gotcha. No, no, I don't. <laughs> My God. Ugh. That was real bad. That was pretty embarrassing. I, I can't lie to you. You gotta want it. So that's the problem. I didn't want it enough. Not nearly enough. <laughs> oh my God, your jump is like no horizontal movement. <laughs> okay, good. That's good enough. Yeah, missile, totally cool. Tubular even, whatever we else said in the 1998. Biatch. Biatch is coming back in a big way though. You might not think it is, but it is. You'll see. Do you like the green guys? I don't know. 
that's fine. Destroy their home. It's the only home they they know, but you know, it's gotta go. I have no, he says eyeball power up or eye power up. I'm not quite sure. So I'm also thinking of the nine there, iconography. So what, uh, the wild nine? Is there nine bosses type thing? What are we doing with that? Okay, this, this could definitely be a thing. All right, give me you. Yeah, I wanna, there you go. That's, that's what we were looking for. That is what we were looking for. Don't lose your head. Like, cool. Yeah, no, not not the most incredible writing. A lot of checkpoints. This first level has been going on. Not an insignificant amount of time here. You just let me through? You just let me through? Nice, nice. I mean, I'm feeling boss now, right? Like this guy. Is that... What? Oh, that was like a one-hit kill? Well, okay. So now I'm ready for whatever that was. This mecha just appeared out of nowhere. Okay. Yeah, that wasn't that big of a deal. <laughs> They're kind of setting him up to look slightly scarier than he is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm all heal all. No! Yeah! Scary. It's so getting your home. Are you too good for your home? Ah, oh, Jesus. Okay, I have to do one for this. So I have to carefully navigate and not kill one in that grinder, huh? Okay, okay. No, get in there. Yeah. Please let me ju just have to do with one and not multiple. No, I crave blood. All right, once multiple, okay. Nope. <sighs> okay. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Finally. Just grinding for them grinders. All right, up, oh, gotcha, but anything here, I feel. N no, I thought I knew shiny entertainment, but I guess I don't checkpoint again is wait, is this game one whole long level? I didn't know that that's crazy that I figured that out uh, One of our pals Volstag has been captured. We can't leave without him get him to the emergency teleporter for the great escape You'll know it when you see it Colossus Uh, You want to you want to go? Okay, you're just kind of running alongside me. That's cool. That's the great escape. You want to go? What's happening? Wait, we're physically pushing this out of the way? That's so weird. Let's go into that, I guess, Volstag. I guess I must have... I, I needed to leave the demo running to get a story sequence, because I'm kind of shocked there wasn't really one uh, at all. Oh, it's just Earthworm Jim's pocket rocket. So, so no boss. Just save dude from something. And I got that guy, and we're torturing him inside a musical instrument in a door? I don't know. Are right, going to the gulag, which sounds nice. So here's the thing. That's the main gimmick of the game, right? You have this energy tether and you're throwing things into things. So the whole gimmick of that needs to be explored differently in each level environment. So you at least have a sense of like, oh, there's more to this than just doing these one or two things. Because Earthworm Jim got by with like, you know, this crazy sense of humor and levels being constantly different. So let's hopefully hope that uh, a second level is gonna... Okay, no? Uh, the only way to put fire jets out is to grab the closest slob and smash him into the fire nozzle. Three good wax and the fires go out. Do you smell bacon? I smell bacon! Okay, at least it's like you don't have to destroy... It. You have to destroy like a whole enemy. You just have to do several whacks with that enemy. Okay, that's at least something. I know what that weird helicopter is doing. All right, all right, that's not going well. Ow, ow, ow. Fire indeed hot, my ass. Did that count? It's on fire. It's, it's I, I, one more, maybe, maybe, we shall see. Here the ultimate 2.5D game is. Let me know if you want me to play this in the comments. Remember the Tarzan game on the GameCube or like the PS Tarzan Untamed? That game is sick as fuck, I think. I don't know for sure. It might be. It. I think it is, actually. Never mind. It's sick. Wexcellent! Wexcellent? You... No. No. Only I can make up stupid words. Wexcellent. So I do like how more metal this level is with the music and the industrial theme. Uh, ooh, what's this? <laughs> it's a giant key box. Really? Come on. Come on. That's how keys work. 
so I do think this makes sort of a slightly better impression than the, the first level. Karn has set nasty traps all over the place. Who is Karn? The snake pit is one of the nastiest. The best way to pass these delightful areas is to grab the closest trooper. And to, yeah, the, the, the best way to do this thing is to do the main mechanic. Gotcha. This is the snake pit. So can I... I can use his body. Excellent. That's that's good. Wexlent. No, no, no to Wexlent. Is his name Wex? I think his name is Wex. I don't think it's actually been said in this game yet for those that are new to this. Some areas are guarded by machine. That's like mean saying like Mattitude or like... <laughs> she did say once or twice. Mattitude or like... Mattastic. Maxlent. Well, that's for Max, actually. Constantly spew out these annoying little green schmucks. One grenade or three missile wax auto polish these. Yeah, yeah, things come in threes, I've noticed. Like, like, what, what can we do in our game? Let's make these annoying creatures. <laughs> okay. Sick. Good idea, bruh. Mmm. So, yeah, I should go back there after grabbing this dude. After grabbing this dude. Now, can I make this off one jump? <laughs> yes, I can. Oh, no, he just died because of the trauma. Wait, this is not producing any more bad guys? Hello? Machine? Machine? Or maybe this is the maximum amount of enemies, enemy character models it can produce. Oh, did I like fuck myself over here? Possibly, that's great. Always down for that. Can I pick up the bodies? There you go, that's why. So it can't produce more. Like that's the max amount the game can actually do. No, stop. I need another fucking body. But now I got rid of all the bodies. <laughs> so I'm really fucked. All right, all right. Pick that up. That's enough. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just damage boost through that bitch. That's how you do it, kids. That's how professional people like me. Dude, get out of here. Fuck you. Oh. <laughs> The delay! The delay on those missiles, though! Oh my god, back here, huh? Uh. Alright, this, this is how I was supposed to do it cr Oh, fuck. This is how I was supposed to do it correctly. Hold on. Hold on. No. Still won't let me. No! Alright, never mind. We're just gonna have to... <laughs> Wexlin! <laughs> Great, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is all good. This is exactly what we wanted. Oh, those missiles are so annoying. Stop it. Oh my god, stop. That's how close I was to the checkpoint. Damn. Sorry, dude. Need my soul taken. I'm getting my soul sucked. Oh, never mind. Lost soul continues. I didn't know. So you're just dead. So, so that is Wild 9. Um, yeah, it's it's not bad. I, I think this is something if it uh, got moved to the PS2. It probably could have been uh, a lot better, a lot more nuanced, and, and look a little better. But considering I think uh, Shiny made this, their first PlayStation game, in just two years, because Earthworm Jim 2 is 96, if memory serves, it sometimes doesn't. Uh, so this was 98, so yeah, they only made this in like, you know, less than two years, just about. So yeah, not too bad in that sense. At the same time, it does feel a bit janky and the mechanic is still like unclear about, I, I think if it was a 3D game or a bit, had a bit more 3D movement, it just feel a lot more natural and smoother. Still though, um, it, it holds up. I think if anyone has good memories of this game, you still might have some fun. But let me know what you thought about it in the comments below. If you'd like me to play any more games like this on the PlayStation era, if you give me some suggestions, that would truly be excellent. Ugh, I hate myself.